Hi, I'm Chris Marshall with Woodworkers Journal Magazine here at IWF with CNC Shark and Tim Owens. Tim, what would you like to share with us about CNC Shark? Well, we've been working seriously on accessories this year from the new CNC Shark. Yeah. So what we've worked on is a new touch plate feature, which allows us for people before would have to put the uh, would have to manually set the Z. Yeah. Now you can put this underneath, have it come down, touch the plate, and it instantly determines the height of the wood. We've also added a vacuum feature, which is a magnetically attachable unit, which allows for very easy plugging in, keeping the dust down, and then pulling it out to be able to get at your bits. And then we've uh, started a whole new uh, fourth axis capability. Oh, really? Which allows us to be able to machine uh, either in in rotations, indexing, or completely turning it and machining it on all axes. Now, the, the addition of the fourth axis, does that mean a whole new machine, or is that a software change? Or No, that's an accessory that I will see. attach to the side. So it's a converted lathe that sits right here on the side okay. of the unit, and then it's the routers turn 90 degrees, and you can machine everything right here. I see. So that you don't have to, all the previous shark owners are able to utilize this. Boy, that's just great. Some minor modifications. Now, in terms of the new uh, the new features, what's available now and what's still forthcoming? The touch plate, the vacuum is available immediately. Mm -hmm. The fourth axis we're looking to have around Christmas 2012. And can we talk about street prices for the new features? These are $89, both of these features here. Each? Each, yes. Mm -hmm. Each one is $89. The conversion kit with with the lathe is approximately, depending on which lathe you get, is going to be about a thousand dollars. About a thousand dollars. Now, if our readers want to find out more about the new features, what's your website? Our website is cncshark.com.